let's just go to what we're doing here. Making things go blue. How? We're using ultrasonic. Ultrasonic, so the chapter. It's using ultrasonic energy at, let's see, let's flip this thing around. At 25 watts at 22.5 kilohertz. And 25 watts of that is a lot for... And this is vegetable oil with lots of oxygen and candle wax. Which you added, right? <laughs> Accidentally, I may or may not have done so. And anyway, it helps to switch. It, I actually, that's how I make the fire half the time, is the candle wax will leak, leak down into the flame. And it'll make it candle wax easy. seems to be more flammable than vegetable oil. Well, it, it's kind of for burning. Oh, uh, yeah. There we go. Shit, did you see that? The, did you get that? The the the, the sustained flame? Is it was over here and all the candle? Mm-hmm. I got it all. It's still, well, it's still filming, too. This is an ice bath for the tip. We're technically not supposed to use this out of water. I uh, know, because it overheats. It doesn't, it doesn't help that it's being used inside of a flame. It's healthy, Phil. There we go. It's yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, um, we need a bigger candle, I still think. That's the power output meter, by the way. Um, I'm not Yeah, this is pretty cool. And I got it on video, too. Oh. <laughs> uh, try and aim it towards the metal thing. <laughs> Help me, Please. It's my hair. I don't want my hair all over it. You're the one who got me into this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When it, when it doesn't power on immediately, you should probably put it in the water for now. Cause you're, you're, you're redlining it. Okay, you're not. Okay, fine. When it blows up, you make me make you buy a new one. Probably gonna buy one anyway, aren't you? I'm glad I didn't sell this thing. It's fun. It is. We need a better candle. Well, now we do. Hmm. Should I go find one?